uh, it was uh, uh, pushing it down the uh, road a year or two or four up to four years because there we knew that the the very Democrats themselves, for example, Rick, that wanted to push this last night or technically this morning, they don't even they can't vote for two point eight or two point two billion dollars in tax increase. Right. Right. They, they themselves that had, that pushed this and 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 reneged on a budget deal, they themselves are not going to be able to come up with the votes for two point two billion. You know, it's yeah. totally nuts. Yeah. Well, and especially when it was even something part of the WEAA said they didn't want. I'll tell you, the, just the whole thing uh, was it was really bizarre. It was actually one of the most uh, bizarre things that I've ever witnessed because everybody really thought, okay, we're going to do. A couple more bills, and we're gonna we're gonna go home. And everybody was looking forward to not being back in Olympia for a half a year. Right. Okay. And then all of a sudden, uh, everything fell off the rails, and and we're we're hearing about uh, 1351. And it was really interesting if you watch the if you watch the TVW footage, a couple of Democrat senators are probably the target of some pretty bad things this morning because <laughs> they were the ones that came in and they actually said, hey. These guys are right, meaning us. There is no way to afford this right now. We already agreed to it. So I think that there is some, uh, you know, turmoil within the Senate Democratic uh, Caucus right now. Yeah, no, I, I would think so. Well, uh, Brian, thanks for calling in with this. Uh, that sounds about like what I, I guess. I guess I guess I do have a handle on it. I just didn't know that because there was so many moving parts of this last night. Yeah, I mean, I really appreciate your coverage of it. I mean, the... the it, I everybody. I hope everybody goes and watches the TVW clip of how this all came down, because it's fascinating and it's also embarrassing how our government operates. Really, and then it's just really interesting. There were a lot of moving parts, and and uh, you know I believe that the Senate Democrats have chosen to hold the state hostage, yeah, and uh, rather than uh, get a budget done, and, yeah. and that's on them. All right. Well, drive safely, my friend. Thanks for the phone call. I appreciate it, and hopefully we'll uh, see you coming up for the Fourth of July. Okay. Hey, thanks, buddy. I right, can't wait care. to see you. Yeah, you too. All right, Senate uh, Senate uh, Senator Brian Dansel from the.